What's up, y'all? J.R. Raymond back again, coming to you from Shopmakers Pro Shop here in Toledo, Ohio at New Glass Bowl, uh, where today we're going to take out a couple of new bowling balls. We've got the two new Storm Balls, the Insight and that High Road Max. Uh, first up, we're going to take that High Road Max out here because it's that stronger cover, that Axiom cover. Uh, same thing that's on that, or the NEX, I guess you'd call it. Same thing that's on the Proton Physics and the Axiom. So we're going to take it out here, and we're going to see what it's got. It's got that normal, uh, it's, I guess, it's got the exact same layout as the legacy that I did, that Motive legacy. So it's 50 by four and a half by 30. Puts the pin pretty tall on my above my fingers. So we're gonna take it out here. 44 foot league pattern. It's got a few shots on it, but not much. Still pretty fresh. Uh, we're gonna check it out and see what we got here in a minute. Stay tuned. Let's take a look at this high road thingamajig. What is it, a high road max? I never get the names right of bowling balls. So I'm gonna try to look a little bit better at names before I do these videos, I guess. But that's not as fun. Just make it as random as possible and as true as possible. So we're gonna start at that 9, 10, 11 range and see what it does a little bit straighter. Very smooth. I mean, if I'm being honest, I hated every high road that ever came out. So I don't expect this one to be any different. So good luck getting a good ball reaction out of me on this. But you never know, it might be okay. And don't ask me why I didn't like the high roads. I have no idea. I drilled the original high road about five times trying to figure out how to make it look good. Uh, and I couldn't match up with it, so. The closest, I had a high road pearl. That one was pretty close. It, was, it wasn't bad. And this one's surprised I me. Mean, maybe it's because I needed a stronger cover. I'm not really sure. Um, Drill the high road solid. It was junk for me. You know, so I might not be the best person to be doing a review for a high road, but that's okay. So far, it's two for two. Now we'll start moving left. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna move a couple left, move five left with my feet. Let's see what it looks like a little bit further left. Okay, so I don't know, it's hard to argue against that because that was ridiculous. That actually was, that was silly going through the pins. That was not what I expected at all. So what I saw out of high roads before was always over under. I always, it always hooked early or never hooked at all. This one so far is hooking just a lot all over the place. I'll throw one more shot in that, in that area, see if that was a fluke. That one didn't go through the pins as hard, maybe been a little bit left of where the last one went, but it still struck still went through them pretty good so let's start going left even more and see what we got i'm still in a pretty weak rolly hand position so that may be what's helping it i'm not sure all right we're gonna go four more left make like a four and two this should flat ten It tried to. It tried to flat ten. I almost called that. Almost called it. But we're going to. Uh, yeah, it's okay. It goes somewhere on there. But we're going to. Uh, so now we're going to start start getting a little stronger with the hand. I'm gonna stay in the same spot and see if I can't just get a pinch stronger. See if we can get it to go through the pins a little better. Uh, there's the flat ten. So got a little stronger. Got it to read sooner. Maybe got it, maybe got it a pinch to the right compared to the last one. But it's no good for me right now, bud. We'll fix it here. There you go. Just tighten it up, just like that. There you go. 
All right, let me get the spare out of there. <laughs> See if I can do this. New thumb. Oh, that's how it's done, right there. You get that bounce in it. You get that bouncing. All right. We're not changing the scorecard for that. All right, so I gotta get my hand around it just a little bit now compared to the last one. So we're gonna get this one to strike. So I'm gonna stay in the same spot again. Now I'm just gonna get my hand around it a little bit. There we go. So that one we got through the pins better. That one came off the spot real hard. Back in again. All right, try this again since somebody hit the camera. Now we're gonna go back left again. You saw that one got around it and it looked pretty good. We're gonna keep going left. That ain't bad. Ooh, getting lazy. Don't wanna get lazy. Don't wanna get lazy. So, we're gonna have to it would just slow down. But the problem is, is it's such a strong cover. I think we're getting into that spot where you get far enough left. It's trying to hook early. It's losing energy down lane. So but we're going to slow down, get our hand around it, slow down, and see if it'll make the corner. Yeah, just like that. Pretty good. See how far we can go before it really starts to puke. The old man's still liking that ball. That's pretty good. I think the older generation will like this ball. Nice and strong. All right, go on bundle left now. Get into that fifth arrow area. Nice and slow, twirl it up. See what it does. that puke time. It tried. It almost got there. It tried. Uh, not going to do it. All right, there you go. So there's that high road max. Got the name right. Look at me go. Moving improvement. Uh, it, it's all right. I mean, it, it definitely is surprising compared to what I like about the other high roads, which was nothing. I didn't like anything about the other high roads. This one is completely different. This one actually is stronger. And I think it's because of the, the stronger cover. Uh, the the high road solid back in the day I think was a turd I think it was no good to me um, so this is just a little bit different since this cover is a little bit stronger than that so maybe that's what's helping it quite a bit uh, I don't think the the core matches up for me the greatest but from what I saw out here it was actually okay I didn't have a problem getting it to do what I wanted it to do until I got you know past fourth arrow once I got past fourth arrow it really forced me to get my hand around it to get it to continue down lane but again it's a super strong cover. I would compare it really close to the Axiom Solid since it is, you know, the same type of cover. Maybe uh, not as early as what the Axiom was. Maybe that core was a little bit different, but this one definitely did some better work than the Axiom. I wasn't a huge fan of the Axiom. This one I definitely do like better than that. So uh, I think it'll fit right in there with the Proton Physics. Maybe just a little bit weaker. Uh, I think the Proton was a little cleaner. Uh, I'm not really sure. I guess I could do a video comparing the two so that way you guys can see it. Uh, but that's all I got for you on this one. Uh, we're going to move on. We're going to do the insight here next. But uh, until next time, make sure to hit that link in the description. Get yours today over at BowlerX.com. Subscribe, do all that good stuff, and we'll see you guys next time. Take care.